Hi there, I'm Jakob Erland. I'm the head of Giraffe Audio. I do the designs, I do the soldering, I'll engrave the front panels and pack the units and I'll write the invoice. I'm Giraffe Audio. When I was a studio tech in the late 80s, early 90s, the recording business had all the money in the world. And if they, they wanted something that wasn't accessible off the shelf, then I was commissioned to build it. So I did numerous designs of all sorts of audio units for special needs. And uh, some of these units turned out to be quite popular with visiting engineers. And that was what Giraffe Audio started out as. I'm not really sure I feel like being a designer. Very often I'll come out with an idea and make an initial prototype I take out in our studios and I'll get feedback from the engineers here and we'll do a lot of revisions and usually it'll take the unit somewhere I hadn't imagined it would go. So it's like the whole process of design is more like many, many iterations that brings the unit somehow to a place where it wants to be more than something that is designed. So I think of my, my own role like a toolmaker who does the hammer or the screwdriver that the engineers are using to get somewhere new. It's so it's like it's less of a design and it's more like a, a impression of the route you want to go as an engineer. We have the great benefit of being manufactured or actually hand built by a single guy who doesn't need to do it all that quickly. We can do a lot of selection of components. Uh, we don't have to be super efficient and using like uh, SMD machine mount and stuff like that. So all of our stuff is actually through the hole like in good old days and uh, hand sorted by me. I feel rather privileged that I have the time to do single or dual units uh, with, I mean, hand selected components, new old stock tubes and that I actually also can make a living off making high quality audio products like we did it back in the days where music was young. <laughs>